Let's hopefully this worked. Hooray! Okay, so. Hello. Um, you can kind of... Wait, where is it? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wrong side. Maybe it's this side. Oh! Oh, I saw it! I saw it! Oh, oh, there I am. Hello! You can kind of see my hand there, because, you know, that was just me. Not, um, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, I'm playing around with my avatar today, because I did not have time to make myself all beautiful. Because I gotta get this stream in quick, and then get my get my butt moving on, you know, getting my garage sale ready. Because my mom needs me to come out tonight and help set up. Oh golly! And um, I have not done anything because I am a procrastination queen. <laughs> yeah. And so, anyhow. I have no glasses on. I barely. I've got jammies. Like. No makeup. Nothing. So I'm like, you know what? Today's Avatar Day. Because I ain't got time. Because by the time I get, like, completely ready, it uh, takes about, you know, a good 15, 30 minutes. And, um. Yeah, I don't have time for that today. So we're gonna move quickly. Uh, first of all, I need to show y'all dungeons. Kian got me a present! Two presents, actually! Mm-hmm! Mm. And it's in my walk-in closet. Because she was trying to show me. Well, okay, so, they're cloaks. I'm going to tell you that right now. And I flippin' love the cloaks. If I had all the monies in the world, I would buy all the cloaks on the marketplace. Because they're so beautiful, even though I don't have room for them in my <laughs> I'm running out of room for a lot of things. Oi! Hey, Kian, I see you, but I wanted to show you. Kian bought me two cloaks off the marketplace, and I'm so excited because I love the cloaks so much. And then I also made a horrific discovery. I have way too many blue colored tops for my top section, so I was working on that um, today too because I got to get all these new tops that I bought the other day in somewhere and um i was also running out of room for red ones so what i did my and i'm gonna have to do this for all of them is i have just shrunk down the tops like before the size that the red ones were at it went all the way even at the bottom row and i only had like three spaces left down at the bottom so now that i make it up smaller i have the whole bottom row left and i'm super excited about that um and Kian, this is the one that I accidentally deleted and had to go find. Thankfully, it was only the third slot in my bank, so it didn't take long to find it. Ugh. But, yeah, so, and see, my blue tops are completely full, and I still have two more to fit over here. So, yeah, I'm going to have to just shrink all of the tops down. Probably I'm going to have to do that with the outfits eventually and the legs especially, too, because I do want to... Um, I want to add, I, I want to go on a shopping spree the next time I buy a chrono, which is probably going to be in a few months. Um, buy more legs. So, anyways, I had to move my. Oh, here, look at this. this is it, see the glitchy? See, see, their tiles glitch too. That's so exciting to me. Okay, sorry. Um, what, 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 what? need a wee. Oh, <laughs> thanks. Thanks for making me read that out loud online. Anyways, I had to move my cloaks upstairs here because they just weren't fitting in with the boots over in that other really tiny room. And again, I'm probably gonna have to make all the cloaks small, too. But for right now, they're working. It's working up here, so it looks very, very nice. I like it. Um. So anyway, so the cloaks that Kian got for me was this beautiful thing over here. She was um thinking it would look really good in Rosie's room, and I do agree. The only thing is, is that it would fit more for Rosie's room for season three, and I'm not gonna go into why. I just don't know if it would fit well for season one of the C team. So I have to I have to think about that. But the other one that she got me, and oh my gosh, this is one that I have coveted for so long. I wanted it. Look at it, it's so beautiful. It's got me, 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 me. Because um, whenever, sometimes when the marketplace does its 50% off sale, if, you know, I got have a good paycheck at that point, um, I'll go and, and buy stuff if they allow non-members to. And 
I, I wrestle with myself about buying cloaks. So I usually only allow myself like one cloak every time because there's usually other things that I really need to get. And the last time I did it, I got this cloak because, I mean, who wouldn't get that cloak? Now I have that cloak in red because I bought it with plat and I don't have any. I don't look at that. Look at that. Now I have a red one and a blue one and it's fantastic. Okay. But, um, but this was going to be my next cloak actually that I was going to buy <laughs> for real. Like if I ever, if I ever had enough, um, yeah. So I'm hella excited about that. Hella excited. Okay. So that's, that's enough of this fluffing about in here. Ugh. Yeah. I flip and love that cloak, but see now, um, I don't even know when they're going to have one. Of, they haven't had one of those sales as to my knowledge in a long time been a few years uh, uh, that I think unless I haven't been paying attention I might not have been paying attention but and usually it's for members only but now if they have one of those sales in the next few weeks I'll be buying the stuff for the C team house and so I won't because that's I'm trying to save up money because I need to get um I have to get the Dungeons and Dragons game board and I have to get the uh horse the mount, which mounts are what, like 20 bucks, I think. They're, uh, I'm having a panic attack. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. This is going to be a ground one. I think it's a unicorn. Yeah, look, 1950. That is $20. $20 US dollars. So, um, yeah, that sucks a lot. Uh, but so I'll get that and then I also have to get the carriage which I don't if I remember correctly the carriage and the Dungeons and Dragons game or it's like driders and something dragons and driders or whatever that they call it on here but it's not they're not that expensive they're like two dollars or something like that why why haven't you gone yet you crazy woman okay so housing oh wait do I have enough house railings because we're gonna be doing finishing off the ceiling, getting in the um, crown molding in there today. Uh, I think that Cathrissa's room is just gonna have to have the Hallis railings uh, and the ceiling because I don't have black marble, and I don't think black marble is really gonna be hard to see in Cathrissa's room, anyways. So um, let's go make some more Hallis rails, and then I also wanted to get the office done today so hopefully and that won't take long that is literally it has been canon since the beginning and he has reconfirmed it many many times that in that office there's literally enough room for a table and a moldy nasty bookcase that no one would ever even conceive of putting books on so um that's it and that's all that's going in there i'm not putting a rug i'm not doing any other decorations it is law <laughs> that that's what's all that's in that office so easy peasy Ugh. and then it's just like things like filling the um filling the uh oh what's it what's it called the bar with cups and all the filling the kitchen up and the storage room which i have plenty of item count for so i'm not even worried i gotta make the barrel of uh and I can't remember what the stuff is called. I will have to rewatch it. Which honestly, I think that takes place in season two. No, it doesn't. Does it? No, it doesn't. It happens in season one. Um, we are joy on the barrel with mushrooms growing out of it. <laughs> and then I have to put little signs everywhere in certain places. Imagine a dark something. Cause that's all inside joke there. Mail. I don't have mail. I ain't got me none mail. So meh. Ugh. Um. So yeah. What am I doing? Palace. Palace rails. Okay, so we gotta make, I don't know how many of these. Quite a few, probably. Uh, each room is probably gonna take at least eight. So there's four rooms plus the office area, which I don't have the ceiling in yet, but I will get that in today. So that's um, eight times four is what, 32, and then probably another, we'll just say eight in the office, so 40. 40 sounds good. 
40. Not 45! I did not run to the 45. I can't check my mail. I have not received a mail. Can. Not yet. It take it can take up to um, 30 minutes if it has an item attached to it. We had this discussion before. <clears throat> But, um, so yeah, oif. <sighs> but yes, I will check it as soon as it pops up. But I'm also kind of listening for the laundry. If the laundry goes off, I am going to have to go tend to that very quickly. Um, because, you know, I need to finish washing the laundry so that I can fold it all so that I can find any bits and bobs that I want to sell at the garage sale, so. Because that laundry's been sitting in there for a while. Because <laughs> I procrastinate. Mm. And we've just been washing the stuff that, you know, we wear. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Hold on. Let me see. Let me just check just to make sure. Yeah, see? It hasn't come up yet, my love. I do need to get this off there, though. My one little Tinkerfest cog. But when it comes up, I will definitely... Did you buy me something else? You can't, you can't keep spoiling me like that. You gotta buy wardrobe slots. What the crap am I doing? Oh, golly. I am not awake. So, I went to bed last night at 9. I just passed out at 9. And then, um, I slept until 9. Like, we completely skipped swim team and everything this morning. It was awful. And I'm still exhausted. It probably has something to do with the fact that I was literally, as soon as... Why did I go in Cuthress's room? Because I love Cuthress's room so much. Um, as soon as I got done streaming yesterday, I was cleaning. Like, getting stuff ready for the garage sale from that moment until 9 o'clock last night, basically. So, where do I want to start? Um, we should probably go get the the table and the bookshelf in here. Go get a dumb looking table. Actually, I kind of want to use the same table just because it's almost like, you know, profa. Just threw stuff in here. Do I want the same table? I do like this table. This is a nice table. They don't deserve a nice table. <laughs> We're gonna go get some mink stuff. Balls. Apparently there is a limit to gift. What? I don't understand that. <clears throat> I was really enjoying watching your stream, Kian. I like that um, you're redoing your guild hall. Redoing, not necessarily redoing my guild hall, but finishing my guild hall is definitely on my list, but it's like low on my list. Because um, it works how it is and the thing is is that I don't want to change any of the rooms that were built by my Friends even though they don't log in anymore and like, you know, it's Older style of decorating and and whatever. It's like it's their work And I don't I don't you know, even though they don't play the game anymore I don't want to destroy anything that they have done so and because I still don't really consider the guild even though I'm the only leader that logs in I don't consider the guild mine, like, that I own it, you know, because I'm so close friends with, um, or I was, the creator, so, of the guild. So I just don't, I just don't feel like it's my place to, to change up things. I'll change up my areas, you know, and finish up the areas that I had put forth that I was going to finish, but I don't want to, I don't want to mess up anything else. Um, where the crap am I going? Ugh. Okay. I'm awake. No, I'm not. <laughs> Ugh. What the hell? Laundry takes me just so long to fold. Okay, so you guys have watched me on here. You know. How much of a perfectionist I am about stupid things that don't matter and nobody pays attention to. Can you imagine what I'm like with folding laundry? It has to be perfect. They have to be folded perfect. 
that if I don't fold it perfect the first time, I'm going to unfold it and I'm going to fold it again. <laughs> and so folding laundry takes me days and I have to do a pile of it in like three hours. So this is going to be fun. Ugh. I created my guild, but it needs fixing. Yes, and exactly. I'll try to keep it the same. I'm sure my mom won't mind. No, she she would want you to to make it um, better, you know? Okay, where is that moldy, nasty... I actually really love this bookcase. Ta-da! Okay, that's what we're using. I think I have one downstairs for the shelves in the kitchen, too. Like, just this... That seems like a prof -a thing to do. Um, no, yeah, I really think that, uh, that she would want your, you know, your guild hall to be nice. Ugh. The table doesn't get very big, but actually I kind of like that. Okay, maybe that one. And I think both of these, there's one, some inside, I'm gonna go look at the round ones in the manky wood. Um, so there's this. Uh, but when you make this one bigger, it gets so thick. Plus, that finding laundry and ironing is not, or folding laundry and ironing, it's not something I will do. It all ends up on the floor anyhow. So I lock it in there with no step to it. Yeah. Well, and I have, like, I've gotten a little better because I've started letting um, my daughter fold laundry, and, like, that was a really big step for me, because she does not fold laundry well, <laughs> and so, but it's, like, I still have this, like, this should be over in the nice wood section, I don't know why I have it over here in the manky wood section, whatever, anyways, I, it was, like, a control thing for me, like, I had to get past that and allow her to just do it, uh, I think, I think I want to try to find, see if maybe that one, but I think I'm going to try this one first. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, it's just like in my laundry, you know, I have a lot, you know, a lot of that is my laundry and I want that folded nice and it still takes the towels. Oh my God, towels. Cause we all use towels. They have to be folded just right a certain way. I'm, I'm crazy, I know. It's okay. I have many issues. But don't we all? We all have our little tics and mental health things, and we're all just a little bonkers. It's alright. I'm out of tea. I need more tea. Proper southern sweet tea with more sugar than tea in it because apparently I hate my tea and my thighs. <laughs> that's where all the sugar goes. Ugh. Oh well. It's what's keeping me alive right now and not passed out. Why the crap did I come in here? Oh, balls. I wanted to go over to the shared deco storage and see if any of this stuff was in there. Don Jones, share deco storage, doot doot. I really don't like these tables like this. That you can, the one that's the circle. I feel like if that was, would they actually stand? Like I feel like in real life they'd have some sort of a bottom so that it would, the physics of that just don't seem... I don't know. I could be wrong. Maybe it's got, like, heavy rock base or something that I can't see. It just keeps it stable. Stable! Okay, let me see. Three port. Nope. Three port. Bed. Nope. Damn. Don't have that. Uh, alder. Nope. Damn! <laughs> I don't want to make a... Um, oval... Briarwood. Mm, a pristine, elaborate... Is it the elaborate one? Hold on. No, it's not. But what does this one look like? 
Oh, let's cut the middle. I don't want the middle. I don't want the fine. Um, I think I'm going to actually like the Freeport bedside table though the best because it's like it's supposed to be a small table and I can sink it down to make it shorter because it'll be awfully tall. But. Oh, God. See? See? At least y'all don't have to look at me yawning. <laughs> so, goodbye. Yeah. Oh. But my perfectionism, yeah, it gets in the way of, of cleaning, that's for sure, because I, I want it to be a certain way, and I had to learn that I can't expect, you know, the other people in my house to be as um, perfectionist about them as, as I am, because the reason I'm perfectionist about these things is from, you know, my own trauma. So, uh, and they don't have the same trauma, so I had to, I fought with it for a long time until I finally was just like, fine, I will do all of it, like dishes, putting your dishes, I'll do the laundry, you know, just, I have to have it my certain way. And then so like recently I've really worked on myself to not, to, to allow them to do it their way. To not, you know, to, to because I can't keep doing all the cleaning by myself. I can't. It's just, it's busy. People in this house, we all need to pitch in. And so, but it was more that I had to let go of the fact that they're not going to do it as perfect as I do it. And, ooh, and it really hurts. <laughs> but it's okay. Like, I get over it. You know, I don't have to see my daughter's clothes once they're already in her dresser drawer. So. You know, I can get over that, and, um, you know, as far as the dishes go, I, she, her, her job is now to put away the dishes, and, oh, of course it's never how I want it, but, but, I make do, because I just remember that, you know, it's either she puts it away her way, or I tire myself out constantly, so I just had to, I had to make that choice. You sent me something. Hold on. Once I'm done crafting this, because I don't want to fail, I will go check it out. On my laptop. <sighs> but yeah. No, it's really hard. Like, especially when we have D and D. Like for a long, 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 long time, I did not let people come over, and it wasn't because my house was a mess. It was because I couldn't live with the fact that it wasn't perfect enough for people to come over. Uh, my perfectionism getting in the way again. And so when we started playing D&D &D and we always host at, ooh, ooh that looks yummy. Uh, we always host at our house. And so I have a mini panic attack every single, every other Sunday. <laughs> Still. And like these people are like my friends. They've seen like really close friends. It's not like, yeah. And I still... I come home from church and I just go and start like scrubbing down my whole house as fast as possible. Things that don't even really need to be cleaned drives my husband crazy, but I can't. I can't let myself not do it. Oh my gosh, Ud, pull your hair out if you came. Oh. Well, and see, that's the thing, is I don't care about other people's houses. Like, you know, I've walked into nasty houses. Nasty. Doesn't even phase me. Roaches crawling everywhere. Nah. Doesn't bother me. Like, that's your house. You have your house how you have your house. And that's, that's fine with me. Like, you live your life. It's just that I don't want, I can't, I can't handle the thought of people judging me for my house not being perfect. And it's like, I know, I know deep down that there's no way that these people who are coming to my house would actually judge me for what my house looks like. I know that because they're really good friends and they're really nice people. And, you know, I just, I just can't get over that fact that for some reason, it's just crazy. Okay, tiny bookshelf. And then, so I was thinking, 
but you know, maybe someday I'll keep, I'll continue to work on myself. The fact that I allow people to come over to my house every other Sunday is a huge step. So, and then some of them come over, you know, every Sunday to play other games and such. So, here's what I was thinking. So we could just like go down and have the table just like that. That looks like a nice little table. This office is way too big. <laughs> now that I have all this stuff in here, I am going to have to make it smaller. Uh, I know what you mean, hon. I'm like that. Haven't had guests over for years for the same reason. Yeah, exactly. But I refuse to clean up. And the other two won't pick up after themselves. <laughs> exactly. And <laughs> see, that's where I had to get to because it was like I was doing everything by myself because of my crazy and I just, I had to, I had to let it go. I had to be like, you know, Elsa. Just be like, let it go. Um, so, I think, I think, I think, I'm going to, is this going to pop up? Yeah, I figured it would. That's fine. Um, I think I want to make the office a about, ooh, maybe smaller. I'm trying to get it kind of in the center here. Um, about that big. <laughs> I'm really going to make it tiny. Like, this is a tiny flipping office. The other side gets this nice place. You know? Oh, well. That's fantastic. Okay, so let me get that more centered. And then the this will be, like, right there. And you still kind of walk through here. Yeah, you can still make it through, so... Perfect. Can't get all the way around the table. That's just fine. Um, okay. I want to pick these up while I'm moving walls because, yeah. For the simple fact that they're going to be a pain in the ass to move these walls, I think. Mm. Um, will you come out and be good? Thank you. That's all I ever ask is that you just be good. I don't know if this is in the right spot, but and then maybe I can also make, oh, I fixed, I fixed, look at this, I, f uh, let me turn off my light, because you're not going to be able to see it with, uh, anyways, um, I fixed the walls in here, they're not as bad anymore, see, 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 and then when you go this way, same thing, woohoo, so no, no things, no bad, bad things. Alright, uh, let me turn my light back on. But yeah, oof. I'm really not looking forward to lighting. I'm very, 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 very bad at lighting. And see, because I can't be a perfectionist about it, I have panic attacks. Oop, there's the laundry. Okay, hold on just a second. Please don't anyone leave. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. See, I told you it wouldn't take that long. <laughs> um, no, the dry, the wash was done, but the dryer is not done, so I'm gonna have to leave that for a bit. All right, now I'm thinking that obviously this one's not going to work anymore, so bye bye narrow divider. We're gonna get a tall one, which I think I still have a bunch. Yes, yes, please. Okay, um. A couple more. Make it nice. I like. You like. Do 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 do. Okay. I love how all the brick is like different sizes in here. Ugh. All right. That's okay. <laughs> um. Which it looks like I didn't make enough Hallis wood once again. Because I'm going to have to add that one in. And see, I knew this was not going to be 
in the right place, but... Um, let me see. Let me pull out this. Oh, I had four extra. Duh. Okay, we're good. We Gucci. Yar. <laughs> oh, God. I miss, I miss Waffle Curse so much. Oh, I can't even tell you. Ugh. Is there a, a weapon that looks like a crossbow bolt? Oh, it's gonna be glitchy all over that. Yeah, no. That's better. Okay. Because if there's like a, a weapon that can hang on my wall that looks like a crossbow bolt, I may have something that I can. What? 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 You don't want me to have a look see. Oops. <laughs> are you doing? <laughs> um, I, uh, I don't, because then I might have some, oh, what the fuck, I might have something, um, that'll work in Rosie's room, uh, because that is one thing that, oh wait, I can just go to the edge of this, because that's what I did, um, maybe a little farther. Um, in the very first episode as she's heading towards the Drowning Courtier, I believe she, I think it's that episode. Anyways, it doesn't really matter. Uh, s some bandits try to get her. And, um, she, they try to hit her with a crossbow bolt and, you know, she's a monk and she's awesome and she catches it, <laughs> catches the bolt, uh, like roll like you have to she had to, she has to roll to catch the bolt or whatever uh with one of her skills and yeah she caught it and it was amazing so she has that so i could have that like framed up on her wall somewhere that could be a thunk i don't know how not to have a line there um actually i do know I do know how to fix this. Now, that's my horrible British accent. You, you Are you happy now? Or English? I suppose there's, you know, different accents. There we go. That's how to get rid of that BS. Um, what in the flack? Did you see that? Okay, I'm not even going to worry about it because no one is ever going to look up that way. Ah! Okay, it's too big. All right, Governor. You got that far? Yes, exactly, because Rosie is badass. Just admit it. Rosie B. Stinger is the... the, uh... the character you would want to play. Right? Horny grandma? Badass? Horny badass grandma? I mean, come on. That's, like, flippin' awesome. There we go. Is it still sticking out over in here? See it in there. All right. I can't do. I can't do an English accent though. Love. I can do an okay-ish one. If um, if I've been like you know watching Doctor Who or Harry Potter for <laughs> an ungodly amount of time, but I have to actually be hearing the the accent. And, yeah, I don't think I could ever even attempt to do yours well. Um, whoopsie. I think that's going to be too big. It's going to hang out into Walnut's room. The room of Walnut. Uh, let me see. Just to be sure. Just to be sure. Uh, oh, yeah, it does, but just barely. Do you see it? It's like on this corner edge, right up here. <laughs> okay, so I think if I go down one, uno, mas cerveza, 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 yeah, I think it's cerveza. Uno mas cerveza, por favor. <clears throat> <clears throat> 
it's gonna be right about right about there. You don't have what do you mean you don't have an accent? You have a very distinct accent, darling. Um It is very nice. This needs to be... Move your face! Oh, look, I messed that up quite a lot. Um, because if it's right there, that's way too thin. You need to scoot back just a wee bit. See? See? I can do some accents very poorly. But, whatever. Um, yeah, because I noticed, like, and I'm going to say her name, don't freak out, but you and Feb, although you're both from England, have very different accents. Just like how my sister, who lives in northern part of the United States, and my old um, accent, uh, are very different from the southern United States. That I live in now. So. It's just like how, you know, every. That, that, that's why I gotta get in the habit of not saying British accent because you lot all have different accents, even within your own country. So. Even saying English accent is a little. Because there's Southern English and there's Northern English and. It's all very fascinating to me. Oh, I know. But I am fascinated with accents. I cannot help myself. <clears throat> even, like I said, even accents within my own country. Because it is very different all around here. And there's different southern accents. Because you get, you know, like Georgia southern you know like the deep south alabama and all that and then there's you know texas southern like mine it's just fascinating i love it i love it so much okay good 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 Oh, man, I've been talking about dumb stuff for a while now. Come up with another topic. <laughs> I've talked about my crazy <laughs> and my obsessiveness about... So basically more crazy. <laughs> Help me come up with something better to talk about. So I'm not at all ready for my garage sale. Um which we've been planning since the beginning of the summer. <laughs> Talk about you. Uh, my family come from Yorkshire up north, so I'm used to the... Oh, it's called an Emmerdale accent? Oh, I like that. And the other I come from the south. Yay! I have been talking about you and your accent. <laughs> but and then, you know, because, yeah, it was actually Faye who um, kind of pointed out to me, because I was saying British accent... And she's like, you know, well, I'm, you know, Scottish, you know, so I would also have a British accent. And I was like, oh, yeah, I need to think of these things before I open my damn mouth. <laughs> uh, so now her accent has kind of gotten mixed a little bit with the Canadian. And so, and that's kind of what happened, has happened to mine. Like, I don't have a full on, I can get it. If I hang out with enough of my friends, my southern accent comes in real quick. Um, but as far as uh, my, my normal accent is kind of a mix between the north and the south. Because I grew up 18 years, you know. In Minnesota, don't you know, eh? And you always get that, that you gotta pronounce your O's. And that's how you speak Minnesotan. And, um, 
but no, it's kind of it's kind of merged with the South. So you know, it's a howdy y'all, and you gotta get that twang, and I don't know, my, my accent, some sort of a middle ground between that. You don't sound like. I know Faye is Scottish. <clears throat> right, cowboy accent. <laughs> I guess that's what you call it. But see, that's like Texas South. Uh, but like Georgia South, I can't even, uh, like Deep South, that's like, what is it like? It's like, um, um, oh, I can't even do it. I'd have to hang out with somebody. I can I can pick up on accents pretty good, especially uh, American accents. Oh, and then like, I get um, quite the... Spanish or you know Mexican accent <laughs> hanging out with my Spanish friends uh, but yeah as far as other accents like English or uh, yeah English accents Irish Scottish all those I can't I can tell the difference when I'm hearing people between an Irish accent and a Scottish accent but I can't I would never be able to actually do the difference myself. I need more tea. I should have gotten someone who went and got the laundry. So I'm texting. I end up being Australia. Yeah, there's another one I can't do. I think I've mentioned this before. I watched this girl on YouTube that um, literally the only reason I love watch her is because I like her accent. Like, she, she does fashion videos, which, you know, I'm not going to be watching no fashion videos. And, um, she, uh, oh, damn it, that's not, am I out? Oh, no, I'm out of maple tiles. I think there might be some inside the dungeon. Anyways, she does fashion videos where she tries on stuff that she buys from, like, Wish and all those kind of sites, and, um, it's always, like, her, her style is, like, completely 100% different than what my style is, and, like, I would never, ever, ever me nor my daughter would wear any of the stuff that she that she just looks amazing in but i just still watch her because i like her australian accent uh, i have a problem i think i collect accents stop it go away close i collect accents just like i collect anything else good god i am a weirdo well you kind of got to I took sign language in fifth grade, uh, American sign language, and um, and I kept up with it pretty well through my years because I work with you know special needs children, and so I've had to use it quite often. And I have discovered, I mean, I can't speak fluently in it, and I, I have a hard time understanding when people are using it with me, but I can, you know, like I can use it. Um, I have discovered that when I drink way too much, I get past the point of using speech and just start signing <laughs> everything. It's a problem. Uh, maple tile. What? How the crap are there new maple tiles? Ooh, that sucks. Okay. There, there's a, there's a, there's a voice for you. How's <laughs> that? Uh, I learned some sign language from Mr. Tumble. Oh, that's cute. Spanish. No, Spanish I do know. Oh, and I was talking, I was telling you this the other day. I think I tried to send you a message about it. When there's two L's in Spanish, it's pronounced with a Y sound. I think that's how you say it. Because it's like, like chicken in Spanish is P-O-L-L-O, -L -L but it's not polo, it's pollo. And so it's that Y sound for some reason two l's together make that that sound so like when you were saying what word were you saying the other day uh i forget but it has two l's in it and so you say oh tayama is that what it is i don't remember i forget anyways i gotta work on this but um yeah uh but it's something like that spanish is really tricky I, I don't have any basis. If you know, if you know a good amount of French, uh, Spanish and French, just kind of like how um, English and German are, I wouldn't say, you know, exact, but it's like similar. Like you can kind of tell Spanish and French because they're Latin-based like that are a bit um, 
if you can do if you learn French you can probably learn Spanish pretty more easily because I think you said you knew quite a bit of French so or not a quite a bit Uh, where am I going? Crap. I can't remember. But yeah, I had to learn a little bit of Spanish. Because, you know, I work with uh, bilingual children all the time. Like, oh my gosh, you should see these four-year-olds. Like, they will just astound you. We have a program at our school where, in you know, Spanish-speaking children can um, learn in both languages so they they teach one day in Spanish and then they teach the next day in English and so then so they're like um, they're learning both languages and these kids man they are bilingual at four years old and it's flipping amazing and I'm like man that's I need to strive to be better like that and they're so stinking smart too I mean, you know, when you learn two languages like that, it, like, opens up so much more inside your brain. Oh, it's a um, Didn't you hear that in my street? Wait, I can speak French, but only to three. Okay, well, I mean, still. Okay, so you probably, if you learn Spanish, then it'll probably help you learn French a little bit. <laughs> uh, but, no, I don't, I don't, uh... I need to, I know, I know enough Spanish to get me by, basically, but not enough to, oh, and you were trying to count earlier, it's uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez, that's counting to ten, and, um, I know how to say, well, I said that, uno mas cabeza, por favor, is one more beer, please. <laughs> Um, and then, um, escucha a la maestra, that's, uh, listen to your teacher. Um, what? <gasps> Vas estas! Vas estas! <laughs> There's my German coming out! That's another thing that comes out when I'm drunk. And I'm not drunk right now. <laughs> I have my D&D board. <laughs> Good with that. Oh, not destroy. Okay, hold on. Examine. Dungeons and Drachnids. <laughs> it's so fantastic. And you know, the C team does not play with a game board. This is simply. I can't pick this up, Kevin. Because it's not owned by me. And I can move it. I can move it. Move it. Move. Thank you. Um, but I wanted the game board in here just for the simple fact that. And I don't know if I want these guys here, but I'm going to set this here for now. Uh, just to kind of give off... Oh, pff, holy crap. Just to kind of give off the Dungeons & Dragons vibe. Oops. Okay, so... Right there. <laughs> Thank you, Ken! You love me so much! Oh, wow, this is so cool. Look! Okay, so, like, these are, like... These are... These are things you can actually get in game. These blue little. <gasps> I don't think you can get that chest too. This is so cool. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I can sit by the fire and have a pint. <sighs> I'll have to dress you different though. People who come into this bar, if they have full armor on, that means they're going to be part of the storyline. So I have to dress you in like regular clothes. I'll make sure it's yellow. Don't worry. Oh, balls. Oh, one of my laundries is done. But I haven't heard the other one yet, so I can't do anything about it. No! I'll put me in my skirt. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, you love me. No, I won't really put you in yellow. Because I know that, that you don't like yellow, and I would not do that to you. Because I love you too much. Um, how big does this get? Okay, so, it, it, nope, you can't, nope, bar, 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 la, 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 feck you. I said it with an E, feck, feck is not a cuss word.
sorry. How long have I been streaming for? Too long. Ugh, an hour. Okay. Uh, I have so much to do. Uh. Liar, liar, pants are <laughs> It's feck. Have, okay, so you need to see the movie um, Almost Famous. I don't know if you ever have, or if that's even a movie that you... I'm sure you could get a hold of it. It was... An, it was popular enough to be over there and it's old enough for you to for sure have had it by this point um th that's what happens like uh the mom and the daughter are having a fight in the movie it's like at the very beginning and um she's like i hate this house and yada 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 and uh and she tells her t her mom to feck off and her little brother is there, and her mom is like, "Did she just, did she just tell me to f off?" And he's like, "I think she said feck." <laughs> uh, oh, you haven't seen it? <clears throat> I think she said feck. <laughs> I just, I laugh so hard. I love that part of the movie because she did, she did. It was like, and I don't, and I almost wonder if it was like part of the script or if it was something. Uh, what's her name? It's like Zoe. German Zoe Dash or whatever. I don't even know how to say her name. Um, I almost wonder if she meant to say if she was supposed to say feck or if it was like she just messed up and then it ended up working out perfectly for the storyline. I don't know. I love it. Either way, I love a lot of things. Zoe Wanamaker? <laughs> I don't know what her name is. It's like, okay, it's, hold on, hold on, now I have to Google it. See, this is what, this is why it takes me so long to make a house on this thing. Uh, Zoe, it's, oh, da, Des Chanel. Des Chan, Chanel. She's got those beautiful blue eyes that you're like, how is that even possible for you to have such cool looking eyes? Um, I knew it was like Germany sounding. I couldn't remember exactly what it was. Oh, we're going to make this one smaller. Because I don't want it to stick out into Walnut's room because this ceiling is going to be super short. And thankfully, thankfully, Maple is kind of forgiving. Oh, right. Yeah, I recognize the name, but not the movie. Yeah, she was in uh, the movie that she was in that you would know, probably, or have seen. I don't know, but she's awesome. And I love her. She's like... Oh, okay, so, right, we, we need this, this needs to be super short. <laughs> yeah. So about as tall as the other side, if not shorter, because, yep. Okay, we're gonna have to do something about that. So, no, that's gross. We don't like gross things around here. Oh, that's glitchy. Ah, humbug! Um, could I? Should I? Is this so glitchy? Yes. What is that? Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Shh. It's still glitchy. That might not be glitchy. Is it glitchy? Yes, it is. I can see the shimmer! I'm gonna say feck now all the time. Now, am I messing up? No, it's not messed up over here. It's not messed up over there. It's looking, it's looking very nice. Alright, now I sound like Keegan. I can try it. <laughs> I love how small this room is! I can't remember. Did I make that table the right height? Uh, I don't even know. Come here, Kithris. I have to change your rating to 8. I need to. I thought I did. Uh, yeah, it is the right height. I meant to. I meant to from the beginning, if I haven't. Where do you change that? Do I just have to put that in my thing? Or is it in my... 
in this area. Oh, and oh, yeah. uh, you can also do a channel. There might be an echo. Channel. Fixed it. Okay. Um. Ugh. I don't remember. I'll put that in my panels. But I know there's a way to like do it. I'll fix it. I'll fix it after. <clears throat> I think we'll fix it after. So, this is done. Now just to get up the baseboard or the crown molding everywhere. I love how this has literally nothing in it. I almost want to make it smaller. Isn't that bad? Because <laughs> technically you could fit chairs in here. Ugh. I have a problem. Alright, we're going to do this from upstairs. Because I have a feeling that's going to be the easiest. Um. Did you finish? So you don't? I just didn't. I just wanted to know. Like, I wanted to make sure. And if there was anything else in there that wasn't crafts that you wanted to get rid of. Okay. Why is this all glitch tastic and I didn't notice it from below? I will judge it. Oh, I see. It's just it's just melding with that. But can you see that from below? Hold the phone. Oh, I can't fall through. Yeah, I can. Huzzah. Um. Glitchy from the top, which that doesn't matter because I'm not gonna be up there. Yeah, perfect. All right. Um, yeah, I might do that. I might get a crossbow bolt framed in here, real grandma style like stuff. Um, you know, like framed pictures of everything. She doesn't follow a deity, so I can't like get her deity symbol or something like you know grandma would totally have that like picture of Jesus <laughs> um, but yeah she doesn't follow a deity her deity really is shadow and I already have that in there so put in a dang banded sandalwood divider where are you trying to put one in at I assume. Wait, didn't I make... No, I didn't, because I said I was going to make them a different way here. So we're just going to get a general size, and then... You from there. I think this is how big I'm going to make them. Because uh, then I can shove it in about yay. And it doesn't stick through the other side. Right? Okay. We good. We Gucci. Uh, okay. Let me see. Oh, what do I got? I got it on four. Okay. <sighs> Holy crap. Um, if I made this one long enough to go across here... Can I shove it in far enough without having to see it on the other side? The rosy's rosy ceiling is taller, so maybe it wouldn't matter. Because if it's above, uh, no, don't see it anyway. So perfect. I don't have to fluff about with adding too many uh, things in here. What do you think? But some white marble divs on the wall like the black ones in Christmas room and put deep shadow in them as picks or put a few shadow actors see and yeah I thought about shadow actors you really um for like pictures I don't want to give away any spoilers hold on I'm going to give it away to you so let me pull up my messenger uh well i guess 
she does meet, okay, she does meet, I'm not going to send this to you, because she does meet somebody who's all in shadow when she's um, pimping Dinar out to the shadow realm, and they are completely made out of shadow, and it's actually a shadow Rosie, and she meets them in season one, um, and she's very scared by it, and it freaks her out, so do I want to put you know, a shadow person in her room, because <laughs> why would you want something that scares you in your room, you know? <sighs> Hold on, I'm sending you something. Okay. Uh, Alright. I'll make a pick of her, um, crossbolt. Betty? Who's Betty? I don't know. Anybody named Betty. I know a Rosie. That's what I was kind of thinking. Like, maybe just having a, a couple just stupid, dumb, like, granny pictures. Like, all a picture that every grandma has, you know? That's, I was kind of like just thinking about maybe putting a couple of those in there. And then, like, having the framed crossbow bolt, which technically she actually carries on her person. Same with the jar of eyeballs, but again, because we want to showcase some of these things. Um, this one might stick through. Uh, then we do it the way we did. Ruby has whips and chains and knuckle dusters. <laughs> yep. She horny. She a horny grandma. What can you say? She's the best. She's the flippin' best character ever. No. Uh, no, I really, honestly, like, I, I like all of them so much. They, they're they good together. Like, you know, I try to, like, think of, you know, like, do I like this one more than this one or or whatever. The only thing is, is that, like, when Dinar is actually playing his character, or I should say, um, oh, my God, his name just, his name just blew out my mind. Um... Anyways, the guy who plays Dinar. I don't know why I can't think of the name right now. Uh, oh, shit. Like, I like it, but then it's like, it annoys me too at the same time. So, I, But I don't, but the thing is, is like, his character works. It's perfect. It's, it's great, so I can't hate on it. <laughs> so, he was just my least favorite room to decorate. Uh, I don't know. It's hard. It's like, I want to cap, uh, I need to pull these through. This is taking forever. What time is it? Okay, yeah. Alright. Yeah, I'm probably only going to do about two hours, so hopefully I can get enough of this done. <clears throat> but yeah, so I'm trying to think, you know, who's my favorite, and I can't, because, you know, well, I didn't like this thing that this one did, but it worked out perfectly for what this one did, and, you know, they all were, it, they have, it's so, they're all so different that I like them for different reasons, and it's fantastic. And flippin' tastic. There, there's another accent for you. I don't know what the crap I'm doing. What thingies are the Lauren Legend things? Or stick a sub in her corner. Set a sub with a chain on its neck. <laughs> What's a sub? And then what does sh chakras thing is? What's that? <clears throat> I don't know these objects in game. I like that. That looks nice. It's already made the room look a hundred times better just having that in there. Never, never, never underestimate the details. Eh, I should do Walnut's room. Never underestimate the details. Oh. <laughs> Submissive person. <laughs> okay. 
Um, maybe, I don't know. I can get Welver in there. That happens in season one. That happens a lot in season one. <laughs> poor Welver. That poor, poor old man. <laughs> he thought that he found the love of his life. Rosie's like, no, dude, you were just like a one-time thing. And Dinar's like, I've seen everything. I was not asleep. Uh. Hi. And, um, <clears throat> Kian, no. No. But yes. <laughs> okay, so I think we can make this one big. Uh, simply for the fact that it doesn't matter what's on this wall. It don't matter. It's right about what there? I don't know. I'm just gonna keep sending me stuff. <laughs> well, and see, and that's the thing, too. It's like, you know, when she plays her character, it's like, people don't know right off the bat that she's a horny grandma. Like, she plays it like, oh, I'm a sweet, innocent little grandma. And then all of a sudden, it's like, the feck. <laughs> and so it's like, that's kind of what I was trying to portray in her room. It's like, you know sweet little that's why i hid the chains behind the bed because it's like sweet little grandma house one thing that i could add and um i don't think uh, blah, blah, blah. i don't think what, get, let me look in there okay i think that'll be fine um if that sticks out uh one thing i was kind of thinking of doing i want to is putting letters, envelopes, underneath her bed because she keeps her envelopes and stuff underneath there uh, from all of her children and grandchildren because she is legit a grandma, not your grandma's grandma, except in those rare cases where she is your grandma's grandma. Um, but, yeah, because that ceiling is going to be above. Um, that's just another thing under her bed, and her bed is already quite cluttered. With Ecutramol. So, um, I don't know if if it's worth adding that little bit. Because it's not like a huge thing about her. Uh, but yeah. I don't know. It's hard. It is hard. Um, you're still sending me stuff. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. That's not all the way to the wall. Let's see. That needs to move over. Uh, tink. So I don't know. I'm still, I'm still fighting with it, trying to think. Something will come to me. I will get inspiration from somewhere. And something will come to me. Hopefully, now my mom's texting me. Finally going to get to working about two. Same here. I'm doing a quick stream and then I'm going to finish building laundry. Will you be able to help tonight sometime? Of course, that's what I was planning to do. Yeah, I gotta get my laundry folded and then get my booty out to my mom's house. A few geese. A couple manis. Eh. Eh. I don't know. It's hard. It's just not her. That's gonna stick through. I'm gonna have to make this smaller. Because she's, you know, she's a monk, but... It's not like she changes out. None of them change outfits. They all stay inside their same, pretty much, outfit. So it's just... Rawr. And all the geese in this game show your belly. And she don't really show her belly.
You're good. It's good. You're coming up with good ideas. And it would be perfect if, it, if Rosie was just a slightly different person. <laughs> and I, you know, don't, don't get me wrong. I'm not, like, um, bashing these ideas because they're horrible ideas. I'm just, it's just not quite right. Not quite what I'm looking for. I don't know, that's not probably close enough. I probably need to be down here to do this. <clears throat> yeah, because I very, very, very much appreciate all the help. And I figure with you coming up with ideas like that, eventually, eventually something's going to be like, Oh yeah, that's a fantabulous idea. That is the idea I've been looking for all this time. Um, what do I want to do over here? This is, because if I put it uh, just as thick, then it's going to be dumb. It's going to be dummy thick. And we don't want dummy thick. Uh. That's what I was trying to go for. Voldemort. Did I do well then? Cool. See, I can do some accents. But if I make it thin up in this part. Oh, no, I know how to do it. I know how to do this. Um, it's gonna take a couple extras, but. I just want you as thick as this. Dink, 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 dink. Because it can't stick inside the wall, so. That looks good. Okay. And then this can actually be smaller. There we go. So it's oh, not that small. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> I can do this right. Alrighty. Okay, what are we gonna talk about now? I'm starting to fall asleep again. What? what oh. Hee <laughs> hee. Sorry, I keep thinking that you sent me a message on there, but then I realize, nope, you did not. Okay, then I was thinking I can just do thin ones, like maybe this might, how big do I have to make it to fit all the way across here? Well, no, I can, yeah, that, that actually should work. So, what are these, two, three. Quattro. Oh, okay, quattro. Got it. One, two, three, four. Ding, ding, ding. You had the winner. Um, can't stick out through the hallway. But I can put it up. I don't know if this is going to look good or not. Honestly, it could look dumb from below. But it is what it is. Till it ain't anymore. Oh, there's the laundry. Okay, give me two seconds. I will be right back.
Alrighty. See, I told you it would be gone long. Where am I? There I am. Okay, sorry about that. <sighs> the dryer was done, so I had to put the dryer up. I have a table in my laundry room. And then I forgot to bring all of those down. <laughs> Dummy. Um, then I had to put the wash into the drying. And then I had to put the... And put new wash in. So I had quite a lot to do there really fast. Thanks for sticking around. But if I don't get this done, then... This stuff is not going to get sold at the garage sale. I'll just have to donate it, which is fine. I donate stuff all the time, but, you know, since I'm having a garage sale, it makes sense to get this stuff out there instead. Um, but yeah, whatever I miss, I'll just have to, just have to donate. That's fine. Um, yep. Okay. Yay. Alrighty. So let's do this little part here. Can I just get... Are you still working on your guild hall there, Miss Can? Or have you finally drunken yourself into a... Just trying to work around the dodgy area. Oh, yes. So are you trying to, like, completely um, revamp it so that you don't even have to put anything in there? Or are you actually still going to put something in there? Um, this, can you not go down just, like, one more tick? Oh, okay, yeah. Well, that might actually be better. Um, I'm putting travel agents in there. Oh, nice. Okay. That's a good idea. That way you can really spend a good, you know, have stuff that you can sink down and whatnot for uh, your mom's memorial. Because that's what was in that area, wasn't it? Before you decided to... Stop that! I want this board. Give me my board, you piece of crap. Oh, yeah. to go okay awesome yeah you could spend a lot of time on that if you aren't trying to fight around that area I know what you mean like when I did the the Gorowin the the library the underwater uh, library that uh, you video toured that's how we got to know each other um, that dumb thing. Ugh. That was so annoying because it was like certain parts of the floor you could, uh, what's it? You could sink it down in, in certain rooms just like that where it's like, and so it was, you know, I wanted to sink down these beautiful tables and make like this spiral thing. And you notice inside the library part, the red room, that, that I was able to do that, but it was only because of where certain things went. And then there was these blue tables that I wanted to use in the um, blue room all the way upstairs. That was the same kind of thing, the same kind of deal. And I couldn't sink them down, so I had to opt for rugs. It's going to go on the... Okay, that's what you said. So I was very, very annoyed. I am not certain that I like this, but I feel like it's the best. Instead of having these thick boards go all the way in there, I'm going to have to do that in Cathrissa's room also. It's not bad. It could be worse. What does it look like with my light off? Because again, i got to put lighting in here, but for right now, again... Because I'm not good at lighting and I can't make it perfect. It's going to annoy me so much that I don't want to do it. So I just put it off. As you know, with Wace's house and rooms. Wait, 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 hold on. Did I miss something? 
any house with a cellar are nightmares to deco decorate, as you know, with waste. Oh, yeah, I remember because I had to flip everything over to be able to sink it. I didn't know that trick uh, when I did the underwater Gorowitz house. That's why I like to make homes rather than decorate an in-game one. Yeah. <clears throat> I like... I, I if This has been kind of fun in here, being able to make this house, like, uh, inside this bigger house or whatever, but only because you don't ever see the outside of this house. And I think I would have, I don't think I would have taken this on. In fact, that's part of the reason why I put it off for so long is because I had wanted to make the outside area and make some of the places that were mentioned in season, uh, season one like the mines and uh, I had built the mines I had built the long road I had started on walnuts red larch forest and um and no and everything like that and I was building a sky and I was trying to make it a domed sky so it actually looked like the earth and by the time I had gotten all that done I had used up like 400 item count just on the outside and I was like well, shit. And then plus I would not have been able to do any of, you know, these things. The tables and whatnot. I would not have been able to do any of that. Because it sticks out. Uh, the thing with that place, it's so freaking big you can make mines and anything you want because of the space. <clears throat> yes. It w yeah, I had, what I had it is over here where Cathrus's room is. I had a, a tunnel, a cave, the mine kind of going in there. And I did like how I did inside the um, to the turtle house where I had the perspective kind of uh, getting smaller towards the back of the cave. And um, I had that. And then I had the same. I had the red larch forest probably kind of over in this area back off to the side. I was building the red larch forest. And then I had gotten all the outside done except for the the dome of the um the sky but then when i started on the house is when i when i stopped and i stopped for almost all of season like while season two was going on um or whatever because i'd wanted this house done at the end of season one and i started it while they were in season one and then yeah but then I like, I got frustrated because I started building the house and I'm like, well, how the crap am I going to build this house? Because, you know, I'm not good at building structures as it is where you have, where you can see the outside and the inside. And the whole reason, the whole reason I made the outside in the first place was because, uh, I'm going to make this smaller so I can shove it in farther. Um, it's because I wanted the Acquisitions Incorporated sign on the front of the Drawn and Courtier. Uh, yeah. So I just... I had given up. I got frustrated with myself for quite a while. And then I gave up. And then I said to hell with it. And took down the whole dome, forest, everything I had already built. And was like, yep, we're going to do it this way. Because... I want this, I want this to be, you know, I want to be able to put as much as I can into the vision that I had, you know, and not be wasting all this time and item space on silly things like a red larch forest. And I mean, it's not silly. That's very important things to the storyline, but I wanted to concentrate more on the drawn and courtier than the outside. And I wasn't doing that. So. Okay, now here's the thing about you and your structures. Like, you at least have, it seems, an understanding of, um, of architecture that, you know, and you're able, and you know, like, house styles and stuff like that. Because, like, you built, like, my house that you built for me, um, and then there was the, uh, uh, the, what is it called? The sisters, the, um... Oh, the Sanderson sisters house and like so you you have those those house styles and you know how to do that and that's what I was kind of wanting to go for originally when I was making the outside area to the drawn and courtier was this is gonna stick out uh have you know a house sim house style similar to what you build 
but I couldn't figure out how to do it, so... No, it's not going to stick out. Sweet. Well, I guess not without com just completely copying you. It's like I want to... I wanted to have my own kind of thing. And I couldn't come up with something because I'm not good at architecture. Ugh. So, yeah. Oops. Oh, okay. What in the crap? Oh, yay, yay. Okay, so am I going to have to... I'm going to have to, like, jump over here. Can I get over here? Yes. Ah! Not all the way down to the floor! What are you doing, Luna? Your butt. I don't think I'm going to be able to get to... You know what I just did? I didn't move those down yet. Oh, man. <sighs> okay. Yep. Or like, well, and your castle black, too. There's another one. There's another structure that you have built. You've built quite a few structures and buildings that look good on both the inside and the outside. So, don't put yourself down either, woman. <clears throat> I love Dinar's room. <laughs> now, like, it was a pain coming up with all this stuff. I'll probably love Rosie's room eventually, too. I'll get, I'll get there. I'll get there. No. No. Well, that might be dark enough. It depends on when I get lights in here, if it's going to be a problem. I can't put any lights on this side of the room anyhow, because I don't want it shining into Cathrice's room. Because they give us lights, but then objects don't block the light. <laughs> which is a pain in the... Ass. I'm gonna just say it. Screw it. I don't care. Cuss if I want to. Can't make me. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, my daughter wants to go to college. She wants to be an architect. That's her dream, apparently. Well, for right now, anyways. Oop, that's not right. Um, and that's fantastic. I just, I'm not going to be able to help her because I don't understand. Like, I can, I could build a house, but I could not tell you what style of house it is. Like, there's, you know, there's different, architecture has all these names and stuff for things, and I'm just like, eh, I, I just build it the way it works. Okay, Cathrice's room. Shall we? Yes, we shall. Last room to do. But over there, yes. Do 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 do. I need to move it over. I'm just trying to get hungry again since all I've eaten today is potato salad. Now these darn things, these sacks, are gonna be in my way. I should almost do. Except that Ethan here does not get very big. The railings, for some reason, if I remember correctly, because the walls get huge. Huge. I'm wondering how dumb, how, I'm wondering if putting ether near in here is just going to be too much then. Too many runes. Is that possible? Okay. Notice how, um, notice how I'm distracting myself with stuff. <laughs> I don't have to get back to cleaning, though I only have. I, I'm giving myself like 20 more minutes, and then I have to. I have to. Even though I don't want to. Um, I think I put some inside the shared deco. So let's just see. Let's just see how dumb these would look. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna have to flip them over. Cause remember the um stupid, stupid heads don't have runes on the bottom of the railings. But I mean, okay, so if you think about it, if it's supposed to be a railing, shouldn't it be the same on the top and the bottom? At the, you know, when you have a railing, there's gonna be, you see the bottom, you raise up the railing, and you see the, whatever. Anyways. Oh well. Life goes on. Come on, get in here. Where are they? Oh, I don't even know. Ether near. 
Alright, no, no, I know that I know I put these in your railings in here. Rail, there we go. Pick this up. Three of them. Huzzah! Uh, I used a lot less palace railings than I thought I was going to. But yeah, I don't have much to sell at the garage sale, though my kitchen already feels a lot better. I went through and just, like, I have, I still kept stuff where it's like I've used it once in the past year, you know, um, but if I haven't used it since I bought it, that went into the pile. And so my kitchen already feels a lot less cluttered. But I was going through, I was like, no, my next one, no, my next area needs to be my living room. We have so much furniture in here. It's such an oddly shaped room that we've had to keep the room in half, but then it's like too small in half. It's weird. And so, um, I think that's the only reason I feel so cluttered in here because I went through and I was like, okay, what can I get rid of? And then I go through and I'm like, there's really nothing. Nothing that I could see that I could live with get rid of. See how big this gets. Eat the mirror. Where did I put them? Right here. Oh, whoops. Okay. Hold on. If I move it here, then that doesn't happen. Is that better? <laughs> see, see, when I bend over like this, it just gets closer to the mic instead of covering it up with my neck fat. Okay. First off, how big do these get? Okay, you can stop with the dramatic. Yeah, better. Oh, look! Okay, so no, they do get huge. Okay, so that could work. But, does it look dumb? That's my next question. Question! Okay. I'm glad it's better. I want it to be good. Okay, please don't touch the stupid sacks. A little easier on this side to work with since they're invisible, mostly. That's not right. Do -do 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 -do. One thing about helping my uh, mom out with the garage sale is that tomorrow we might have some yummy, some yummy food. Okay, let's go down there and check that. See how weird it looks. I don't know. Yeah, so, ugh, it doesn't. It seems like too much. It's too much blue. I think I'm just gonna go with the normal. It does not bring me joy. <laughs> so, I yeet. Yeet it off. Okay, we're gonna do regular. So, we went through all that fuffing about so I wouldn't have to, you know, get to my cleaning that I really need to get to because I'm a procrastinator. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna turn on my light though while I'm over here. And let's get back to work, shall we? We shall. Okay, stop it. It's a dumb song I'm going to be singing right now. I am going to make his just a little thinner, I think, than the rest. Because I don't want too much of this wood sticking out. Um, is that thick enough? Oh, no, it's not. Hopefully I can get this to sink in there. Yay! I win! Huzzah! Okay. Oh wow, that's gonna go. I gotta make sure that the tentacle is kind of taking over. <clears throat> so yeah, so you know when I talked about you know not having things that scared Rosie in her room, that's kind of Cathrice's thing. <laughs> so it's to be scared, because he and I think it's in episode one where it happens. Or maybe it happened off camera. I don't know. They play a lot where it's like, um, 
because Cthulhu was in Acquisitions Incorporated, uh, the actual show, um, a couple times, so, the show that started it all, um, so they kind of, they kind of reference that stuff, and then they also reference, you know, what happens, obviously what happens in the C team, I think it was like in episode one, where he makes a pact with this god of mouths, that's what he calls it, in the first season, and, um, and because he's a warlock, you know, so that's where he's getting his power, so, like, all of his, but he doesn't, okay, so he doesn't like this god. This god is a very bad, evil, evil, evil god. But he wants to get to, he wants to find the Ur. The Ur has been missing um, for quite a while. And he thinks that, and this and this, this god of Maos promises him information. And that's kind of like Cathrys' crack, is information and learning and knowledge. And so he like, well, yeah, if I can, if I can learn something from this God of mouths, then yeah. So he makes this pact with him and, um, but he's bad. He's this intercessor, but all of his, all of his stuff, all his, um, what you call it? Uh, I'm going to just make it this thick. So I don't know. Cause I can, how big is this going to get? Um, I'm just going to have to move the wall. Uh, is like tentacle based because that's kind of like what comes, you know, from, from, his, from this intercessor, this bad God. And so like his, his familiar is just like a piece, like this weird tentacle thing, crystal, uh, crystalline tentacle snake thing. And his name is Legoti. Um, that's, you know, I'm going to be happy to make Ligotti, uh, Ligotti, actually. Uh, and then his, um, he has this power that Jerry gave him as kind of like, um, each character gets their own special, like, power and they spend bits with it. Like, if you, if you buy bits in, in the game, uh, send it to them on Twitch, then they can charge up their special power. And Cathrysis is the Tentacular Spectacular. And, uh, he, uh, I don't want to make this one too big because it's going to go through the other wall. Um, and basically, if there's something dead around, he can then, uh, like have tentacles burst forth from it and then whatever if he rolls well enough but remember he always rolls a four so it almost always fails and it's hilarious it's so fantastic they play it so well i can't i can't even at how amazing it is and um yeah so and then what other tentacle things? Oh, when he flies. I think he flies in season one. Either way, it's hilarious. So I'm just going to talk about it. Um, he has the fly ability. He says that this thin tentacle comes down from outer space, basically, and wraps around him. And that carries him and carries anybody else that um, happens because he can bestow fly onto anybody else, you know. But when he's flying, he goes completely limp. He has no motor function <laughs> two three four oh my god it's so funny and then like so other people are like um you know they're flying or he'll bestow fly on them and they're like do we have to go limp two three four and then he's like no it's just me <laughs> for some reason i always go limp oh my god it's so funny so yeah so he has one two three four so he has a lot of tentacle things that he does in season one and I'm not giving away any spoilers for later seasons. So that's why, but anyway, so that's why I kind of wanted to capture inside his room was that the Ur is his god, his, the god that he's looking for. He loves the Ur and, you know, whatever. He's trying to find this, this deity, but he uses this god of mouths to try to gain the information, but that he, that god of mouths is an evil god and it's an encroaching on, it's trying to take over things, um, take over his love for the Ur and things like that. So that's why I kind of have it like creeping around and being all nasty like that. What are you sending me? Hold on. 
I was talking so much. What is this? It looks like cake. Uh, but my home. <laughs> that looks yummy. Is that the the cheesecake that you make? Mm. So yeah. Um. But so yeah, so I'm super happy at how the room turned out. Uh. Because of because of all that. Trying to capture everything from season one. <laughs> but I know this is not really how his room looks like. Like, there's no tentacle monster really on his ceiling. It's just kind of, it's supposed to be like a symbol of that god taking over. The god of mouths. No, it's one of them. But it's a keto one. Ooh, yummy. Why do you keep having caps lock on, you crazy woman? You're trying to blow up my eardrums. Okay. Read about there. Uh, I just love the C team so much. I love this show. It's fan freaking tastic. I want everybody else to experience my love for this show. To go out and watch it. Because it's amazing! I gotta turn off my light and see if I still like still like the wood color. I mean, it's not much like not like I have much of a choice because, well, I have no black marble tiles, and I really don't know how black marble tiles would work or black marble railings would work if it would even show up, honestly. Larg. Okay, yeah, the tentacle is showing, but it needs to come. Nope. It needs to come down just a stitch more. There we go. That way it's like covering, it's like taking over the bedroom. Wahahaha. <laughs> it's not like Kathris does anything in here, anyhow, that would be bedroom related. Ooh, goody! I get to. Figure this out. How thin do I want this? Right about there. I forgot that these were here, so I didn't have to. I didn't have to. Okay, we're gonna start on this side. So I get it correct. Oops. Why? Arg. Maybe if I make it a titch smaller. Come on. Get rid of the shivers. Come on. I'm making it so small. Oh, yeah. You know what? That's at the bottom. Raw. <laughs> okay, I guess that we go. Okay. On this ginormously thick one. There. Ta-da! Okay, now, I'm gonna... I think I'm ready to take that out. Um... I did it. Make this big again. So it covers the whole room. Alright, turn off my light. Because I'm not putting any lights in here, so... Yeah, that looks good. The wood didn't look too bad. I like it. Yeah, because the lighting in here is finished. Now it's the rest of the house that I have to work with. But I like that. I like that a lot. Thank you, Kian. I do like this room. Somehow ended up being my favorite, and probably Dinar's being my second favorite, only because of the barfing. <laughs> Let's just make a barfing dragon statue. It needs lighting in here, though. My next favorite is walnuts, because my first swamp, and it turned out pretty good. And then lastly... I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get Rosie's up a status. I got some fiddling to do, but probably off camera. Um, let's see what time it is. Uh, I have seven minutes. I think I'm going to go ahead and get the hallway done. 
That shouldn't take me too long. I don't have any fluffing about to do. I can't get out this door. Okay. Oh, boy. Yay! Your fave room, too? It ended up being that way. Um. Okay then. How do I want to? How do I want to do this? I'm just gonna put more scaffolding because I just I don't want to mess up walls and things. They tend to be crotchety about that. The hardest part is just staying. You know, trying to find that happy medium between staying true to the characters but also putting my own, you know, making this place actually look good. Or, you know, like, a, I don't know. Giving them what is worthy, you know. Okay, so in the hallway, I, I'm just going to make it a tit thinner. Oh, the blacks with the pinks, and the, or the reds and the purples and the... The red almost looks kind of pink, though, with the purple, so. Okay, yeah, so I want this kind of thin, thinner, so like that. Thick. But should I think, um, I think I can make it bigger. Just have to, I don't want to have to lift up these walls, though, is the only problem. I'm being super lazy. I don't want to lift up the walls. Is that thin enough for me? It's actually thicker than the other rooms. <laughs> because why not? Why not be difficult? Um, okay. Okay, that's sticking out, so I don't want that. So it can't be that big anyway, so maybe this thing? That's sticking out? Yeah. A little bit smaller. Okay, that should work. I want it like that thick in the hallway. Question, how are you going to cover the top of the walls so you can't see anything? Never mind, you worked it out. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, uh, once I get the big ceiling in, in, oh, look, it's sticking through. You piece of crap. Um, once I get the big ceiling in, in there, you won't see you won't see any of it. And, yeah. This is why I can't build anything outside of <laughs> my houses. Ugh. Oh, well, yeah, see? Okay, yeah, I can see that. That is not, it's not, definitely not fitting. Ugh. Uh, dunk, 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 dunk. Uh, oh, that's better. That won't show through. Uh, oh, I don't know. Stop it. Stop it! Thank you. Don't be getting on my nerves now. <laughs> I'm going to need like three of them that same size. Ugh. Remember when I said that the hallway was going to be easy? Um, okay, so I can see the whole thickness. We're going to copy the thickness. So I can make it as big as I can. Um. <laughs> Let's just make silly noises now. Okay, then. Why not? Oh, you know what? This could actually just go all the way down to the bottom. It only gets bigger from the top up. So, eh, about that size, I think. Um, yeah, that's about right. And, oh, yay, it does go all the way to the end. So, hurrah, we win. No, 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 argh, fine. 
you piece of crap. Why do you hate me? I forgot. I think it's actually right on it. Yeah, it looks close. Close enough. <sighs> Alright, let me see. So what made you decide today of all days to start redoing your um, guild hall? Or have you been thinking about doing it, but you've been putting it off because you were working on... Oops, that's the wrong one. Working on Jumanji, and you didn't want to have two projects going at the same time, because that's usually what my problem <laughs> is. Um, I do want it, like, at least this big. It has to be at least this thick. You must be this thick to ride. Okay. And we'll have it sticking up back there. That's fine. All right. Hey, hey! Yay! I do like watching you. Are you planning on streaming after I get done fluffing about in here? Because then I can watch you while I fold laundry. And that would be nice. I really need something. Something. I do. Oh, yay. Okay, that's good. Um, uh, I do have Vass's. I started watching it last night. Vass's newest video. Ugh, excuse me. Um, and uh, I'm watching him make his little kiosks, his little shops and such. It's so cool. I love it. And so I could finish that too, but. Um, I only have like maybe 20 minutes left of that, and that's not going to be enough to get my laundry done, so meh. Uh, yeah, that's right. Um, it don't have to be perfect. Yeah, it does. But who, who am I kidding? But, you know. It's got a little bit of leeway. A little bit of, um. I can just get her done. Kind of attitude. Can I copy the size of this? Oh my gosh! Stop yawning! Oh, I did get myself more tea earlier. I was smart. Ha <laughs> ha! Is it helping? No. <laughs> Fine. Okay. Oh, what there? I don't like how that is gonna end up like that. We're gonna go all the way to the edge with it. There we go. Okay. <laughs> That means if I'm done with this, that means I'm done for the day. Mm. Uh, I have to get my car inspected too. Mentioned that yesterday. I don't want to. It's like seventy dollars. Who has like seventy dollars just lying around? I know I don't. Ugh. Um. But it has to be done. Alright, we're gonna get pulled over and I don't want that. <laughs> Oof, that's so close there. That's so funny. Okay, sorry. I got really distracted for a second. Looking so fine, got me all tongue tied. Only thing to say is, hey, girl. Um, how bad does it look now? 
Let's do the... It may not show. We'll see. It's, it's glitchy, but... Glitchy, but... <laughs> Sorry, that was stupid. <laughs> Don't hate me. Ugh, how did I do that side so nicely? It's over it. There might be glitches going on. No, I don't see any. Mm. Why you no want to worky? Because when it's down... Oh, because it's probably a different size. Okay, I think I can let you live with that. Never underestimate the power of detail. Completely transforms a room, in my opinion. That's gross. Look at that. Ooh, I did not get that nice. I don't have to fix that. Okay, what time is it? 2.05. I got like two minutes here. Let's just gonna see if we can fix this quick. Because that's gross. Wait, I should actually move that up so I can measure it. A bit beta. Get up there, and you too. Get up there. Dummy. <laughs> oh! Ah! <laughs> Fine. Tick, 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 tick. This is why. Wait. You got a glitch in your spot. <laughs> oh my god. See? Now look what you're doing. I'm supposed to be doing this quickly, and look at me. Ugh. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Ugh. I don't know yet what I want to do with that. Okay. Oopsie. move now. Nope. And it's gotta be. Okay, I think I want to... Uh, I'm actually gonna lift this one up. No, I'll just shove it down. I should be able to be fine. Should be fine. Should be fine. She says with trepidation. Okay, um... I can't remember if I can go right up close to it or not. That looks good. Much better! And I hope it's not sticking in Walnut's room. Uh, I don't think it is. But we will check. <laughs> Just to be sure. Because that's a real suck if it is. Okay. Oh, 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 balls! Really? It might get covered up. Hold on. Except I know walnut ceiling is a lot. Damn it! Because it's like gonna be right there. <laughs> uh, if I make it just a tit smaller, is it gonna be a problem? If I'm. Like, right there. Any glitchies? I don't see them. Um, if I move back here, is it gonna be glitchy? Because it's like right on the edge. No. Alright. <sighs> Did that fluff things up over here? Good golly. Uh, it might have. Let me raise this one up. Whoops. What am I? Oh, <sighs> seeping shadow I keep hitting. No! <laughs> now we're back to the same problem! Rawr! Anger! Throws things. Ugh. Yeah, I figured it was gonna do that. Ugh. Alrighty. Which that's kind of gross too. Anyways, let's just go like that. No, no, one more. Tick. Okay. Um. It's an easy enough fix. It's just annoying. And I can't get into Rosie's room right now. 
So now I have to go all the way back over on my scaffolding. Ugh. So now I know. Now I know. It's just because I can't see both back there and here. Okay, not right up, butt up against it, but I am going to give it a little berth, like... That. Now it shouldn't stick into Walnut's room. I don't know, I'll have to check. Please, oh please, oh please don't sink into Walnut's room. Because that is not the way I wanted to do it. I did it. I'm so happy. Okay, let's get this all little Okay. There we go. And I see that little glitch. But I'm afraid that uh, coming from this direction. What does it look like if I bring this up to not have that glitch? Oh, okay, so that's not bad. That's not too bad. Alright. Uh, for sure it's not sticking out here. Yay! Uh, I hope it up well, Rosie's room again. And there we go. There we are. We now have crown molding all throughout the entirety of the bedrooms. Yay! That is all done. Wait. Now I see it. How the hell did that happen? Just now. There we go. I guess we're just going to have to do it that way. That is fine. But there's a little, little glimmer. But whatever. So, yay! All done. Um. That's it for my short two-hour stream today. And so I'll have, I'll have these both. Yesterday and today is up on YouTube. Ooh, depending on how late I get back from my mom's tonight. Hopefully today. If not today, tomorrow. Oh, and there's one other thing in real life that I have to do. Sorry for the clap. I have to remember it. Okay. All right. So I'm going to go into Cthulhu's room because that's my favorite. That's what we're going to stop today. Um... Thank you all for joining me for a short, 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 short stream. Um, if you want to continue watching uh, decorating, Kian, who's been chatting in the chat, is going to be streaming here in just a little bit, or at least she says she is. Hopefully she doesn't change her mind now that I've announced it. Mwahaha. And um, so, yeah, so uh, come join her for that so we can continue watching decorating and you know not starve for that all right but anyways thank you again and we will see you i won't be able to stream tomorrow or friday because we're having the garage sale unless we stop early on friday i might stream this weekend and then next week i will be gone so um hopefully uh that will uh uh, yeah, and then school's going to be starting, so I'm not sure. We'll work out. I'll have to work out some sort of a streaming schedule. So, but anyways, see you all hopefully soon. And, yeah, so bye.